Welcome guys back to our video on the channel. Today we're back with some more GTA 5 online. And today, obviously, we had the Drug Wars DLC release. So we have some cars to look at. And uh, behind us, we actually have the Journey too. Which, if you don't know, the Journey is, well, as you can tell behind me, it's a RV. Except for, for some reason, they made it a Journey too. So I'm expecting some unique customizations, maybe, from this thing. We do have, like, these side panels and stuff. So, uh, yeah. So we're gonna hop into it and uh, just see how it generally uh, will be. Okay, uh, so we have armor, brakes, we have, we have the engine, you got some machine under that bonnet. Xeon lights, livery, uh, real quickly let's go ahead and switch it to color that can be seen better, Your cosmetics are on point. livery, uh, classic side arrow, Retro side designs, interesting. Cooking time. Enjoy the journey. Capital M, but that's locked. I've completed that mission. Long live the 70s, long live the 70s alt. Uh, Pride Do you need a drink? Hippie designs. Um, tie dye. Okay, so nothing like absurd. Actually, to be fair, not anything actually that bad. Honestly, I might go with this blue. Kind of looks nice, I think. Um, which actually, let's see. what. Maybe I can find a nice Libby that could be nicely matched with some colors. Um, I think I'll just go with the joy of the journey, honestly. Um, we have the plate. There we go. We have respray. Um, I think... Let's see here. Where's Shadow Silver? Shadow Silver I know is like a nice color, but it doesn't really eh, doesn't pop very much on this actually though. Um I would like to do like a very like dark light blue, if you get what I'm saying. Like a light blue, like I guess I'm like this actually. Yeah, like this color. Okay. And then secondary, I assume also controls the back. So it controls the back, controls the top, controls the side and the front. Okay. Um, so what do we want in combination with that blue? Did not mean to do that, but okay. Um, could technically do the same color, but I think that's a bit too much. Um, brown, eh. Might just do black. Black might just be... Yeah, black just might be the best option for this, and then just have light blue in the middle. Yeah, I think that looks good. Which also, actually, let's real quickly go back to the primary color, because I think I'd actually get the exact blue that's used down here. I think this is it. Yeah, I think this is more of the blue that's used down here, so it matches a bit more. Uh, trim color. What is trim? Let's go ahead and just go ice white. So right there. Pretty much just that. Anything on the interior? No. Okay. So go ahead and get back out here. Let's see. So that right there. Um. If you can think could probably do that like a bright blue, maybe. I don't know. That's a interesting spot for that. Why is like? That's interesting. Yeah, I'll do like a ultra blue. Looks interesting. Transmission turbo. Uh, wheels, I'll do in a little bit. Windows, well, obviously black out, why wouldn't we? Um, and yeah, I'll go and customize the wheels real quick, and then, uh, yeah. Okay, yeah, so here we are with it. Obviously, I don't think I... I might bring it to the airport to do a top speed test, but probably not. But, man, I don't know. We'll see. Um, but what in the world? Okay, this thing actually turns good. Wait, what? Why does it turn so good? I mean, I don't expect this thing to go too quick, but actually with... Wait, so how fast... We're, I mean, 80 miles per hour ain't bad in that amount of time for this thing, honestly. Um, so, you know what? I actually will bring this to the airport to do a top speed test and check out its interior. Um, so, uh, yeah, I'll uh, see you guys when I get there. Okay, guys, so on my way over here to the airport, I honestly have to say, this thing actually handles fantastically. Like, this is actually, like not bad it has decent acceleration 
and it's got good speed it feels like for its size at least obviously and it's got good turning as well like look like it's not bad actually like i can like look i mean i'm about to flip it if i keep doing that but still it's kind of absurd how good this thing is um so yeah we're gonna bring it in here and actually look at it um so yeah okay yeah, so we're out here i don't know what's gonna exactly open up on this i'm interested to see if anything really okay so we got the side door at least um i guess we got the side door that opens up so actually wait a second i want to see how many seats is this this might be a six seater yeah this is a six seater that's actually pretty sick so it's a six seater um and yeah that's all that opens up is the two front doors and the side door but you can see you have the two driver seats you have these two seats behind the driver seats and then well i can look through the front and you can see that we have the other two seats back there um be kind of funny if this was a seven seater and someone could just like lay on the bed but no nah, it's nothing still be funny though if, it, if you could um so yeah let's hop in this and i wasn't planning to do a f top speed test for this thing but with how it's handling is i honestly i'm gonna do it because it actually might be decent so yeah guys as you can see as i'm going around here you can see this thing actually like that's its turning radius that looks bad but it really isn't that's pretty decent for this thing um in terms of turning radius right there so yeah surprising how good this thing is um though here we are we're hitting 80 now um though on the way over here i think i was probably going 100 so i have a feeling it might be able to get up there which thing that might have been with a boost from curbs and also you know uh the way gta physics work in terms of if you hit like a bump in the road you all of a sudden get a rocket booster um so yeah there you go like probably like 82 or 3 something like that um Actually, no, that was probably like 95. Never mind. Um, so, yeah, honestly, I mean, is it worth the money? I mean, to be fair, if you have a lot of friends, like if you have like a group of six friends you play with commonly, for 790000 which is what I paid, or if you just do, uh, I think it's, what is it? Yeah, the first dose mission, if you just complete that mission, which I think is a very easy mission, uh, if you complete that, you can get it for 590000 which is so two or 600 grand. Um, I mean, yeah, it's a six-seater. And, yeah, if you have a lot of friends that you just hang out with commonly in GTA, this might just be a fun vehicle to buy just to mess around with. Um, and it's not actually bad for getting around the map because it's not, like, really, really slow. It's actually decent in terms of acceleration and stuff. Well, I say decent. It's just now hitting 60, but you know what I mean. Um, but, uh, yeah, either way, um, if you guys did enjoy the video, I'll start to leave that subscribe. And will this work? I'll see you guys next time.